what's happening guys welcome to rch tech tv today let's have a look at a budget pc under 12000 rupees or under 200 us dollars which is capable of editing videos and i'm also going to suggest you a compatible uh, free video editor as well so make sure to watch this video till the end this setup can be used for office work uh, for kids who have just started learning computers as it can run low-end games and it can also be used as a backup pc so all the links for these components will be given in the description box below so you can check them out so for motherboard i went with gigabyte f2a68 hms1 which has dual channel ddr3 dimm sockets one pci express x16 slot one pci express x1 slot and one pci slot uh, regarding ports and connectors it has two usb 3.0 ports and four usb 2.0 ports for the processor i went with entry level amd a4 6320 which is a dual core processor and has clock speeds ranging from 3.8 gigahertz to 4 gigahertz to cut costs i went with two gigs of strontium ram uh, that I believe is more than sufficient for my work. Uh, if you feel your work demands more RAM, you can always expand it by adding higher capacity ones. I went with Seagate 500 GB hard disk, which will cost you around 2500 rupees. For cabinet, I went with Zebronix Leo, uh, which I got it for around 1000 bucks uh, in the local store, uh, which has a designer front panel, transparent side panel with multicolored fan. Uh, which uh, really looks good. If you can't find this in the local store or online stores, then you can go with some alternate cabinets at around 1500 rupees, which are available uh, on Amazon, uh, which should be still in the budget. All right, guys, let's get to the performance aspect. Now, firstly, download VSTC free video editor, which is completely free. And I've also made a tutorial video or a beginner's guide uh, on how to use it. I'll leave the links in the description box below. You can check it out later. Now, the combination of this hardware and the software, which I just mentioned, works out to be good. You can not render 720p videos without any issues. But uh, when it comes to 1080p videos, I did notice that it will take a little longer. Uh, but anyway, it is possible to render full HD videos. So at the end of the day, it will make you wait a little, but it should be fine by and large. It can also play some entry level games like GTA Vice City and NFS Most Wanted without any issues. So guys, here's what I paid. I actually got good deals in offline markets. Hence, I would suggest you to check prices in online and local markets. And wherever you get good deals, just go for it. All right, guys, as I mentioned, it can be used for office work as a backup PC. You can gift it to kids who are just learning computers. Or if you have started a YouTube channel and don't have a lot of initial capital, this should serve the purpose for a year or two. So that's it guys, if you feel this video was informative, give it a thumbs up, share this video with your friends and family, follow us on Twitter at RCH Tech TV, subscribe to us on YouTube. Most importantly, thanks for watching and I'll see you real soon.